I'm starting off this video in the bathroom because so my sister's coming over tomorrow and I thought it would be fun for a video if she gave me a makeover. I've done my mom gives me a makeover. She's probably given me a makeover before like a long time ago. I think she has, but I look really different now. I I don't know. So I thought it would be fun to invite Aspen over. Sounds like I said Aspen over instead of Aspen over. <laughs> I thought I would invite Aspen over. Of course, the first thing she said was to put on self-tanner, which is fine. Putting on self-tanner is just such a task. Okay, I'll see you in a minute. Hi. <laughs> My sissy's here. Hi. No. <laughs> Finally giving her the alarm system. So Aspen has been saying that she has a present for me. So the first one is an alarm system for my new apartment, which I am very excited about. And then I was gonna like wrap it and put it in a bag, but it was really I was like asking mom about it. I was like, what even is it? Did I tell mom? Yeah, cause she knew. Okay, I'll just show it to you. Okay. First, is two Hello Kitty Oh, hi, G. <laughs> Thank you. And the second is a Hello Kitty Oh, look at you. No way. <laughs> Wait, where did you get this? I literally was on Amazon yesterday and I was looking up like Hello Kitty stuff to have in my really? kitchen. Yes. And Hello Kitty pasta sauce. <laughs> I think I've seen that. That's so cute. Thank you. You're welcome. Can you get down? Can you go off my bed? Hey guys, so today with my sister. Can you watch I'm gonna her a makeover. I'm gonna get powder everywhere. <laughs> First question asked you by. Do a, like an intro? Yeah, I did last night. Okay. I was like, my sister's coming over, so I'm doing self tan because Woo! that was part of the makeover. If I haven't, hi, I'm with my sister and she's gonna give me a makeover and we're gonna answer some questions while we're doing it. First question asked by Kennedy Walsh. Favorite thing about Did each you other. know me? Yes. <laughs> you go first. <laughs> I really admire your work ethic and your drive. Um, I like so much. <laughs> Thank you. Like, sounds so <laughs> awkward. <laughs> what do you like about it? Like, I just feel like it inspires me to like work harder and be more productive and more consistent. Okay, your turn. What is the question? I like that you always think about other people's feelings. Except when you tell me to shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Can we talk about how you were mean to me growing up? No! <laughs> stop talking about it! Does it make you sad? It does, but it's like there's nothing I can do. I'm so yeah. sorry. <laughs> and I always thought you were like, like I knew that I was, but like two days ago, don't put these screenshots in. I'm not going to. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, you're always like, oh, you were so mean. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, like whatever. And then like two days ago, she sent me like three screenshots <laughs> of our old texts I found on my yeah. old iPad. From like 2014 maybe. Mm -hmm. And they were so bad. Whatever. <laughs> but I'm not mean anymore. It's just, I was just a different person. Yeah, you were just different. Like even you were like mean to mom and you would like yeah, never be mean, never mean, to, mean mom to mom anymore. Yeah. I just was not like that as a teenager. Like I'm obviously still. Like a teenager, teenager, but like, yeah, I'm just not mean. Yeah, <laughs> but I feel like times are just like different now. Yeah, I feel like that too. Like, like we're in like that. a totally different like situation. Yeah. So. I shouldn't have been mean, but. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this one's interesting. What's the biggest similarity between you two? I feel like we're so different, but then we're also really similar. But then I like don't know how to explain that we're similar. Do you have something? No. We're not like that different. Yeah. I feel like maybe just the things that like mom has taught us. Like I feel like we're both like nice and considerate of. I feel like we're both like smart. Both, like, like we both like are not, I don't know. I was talking to Caitlin before she left about how there's just like a circle of people who are just like normal and not weird. And I feel like we're both yeah, we're in not that weird. circle. <laughs> and I don't know how to explain that. But when she said that it like, 
I instantly like understood what she was trying to say. Have you guys drifted apart since Aspen got married? I feel like we got closer since you got older. Yeah. Because you got nicer. That was a long time ago though when I got married. That was five yeah. years ago. That's yeah. half a decade ago. What is something you both did together as kids? Our photo shoot. Yeah. And making all of our videos. Yeah. And I'm so sad because not videos. to blame stuff on mom and dad, but I feel like we weren't smart enough to know how to back stuff up and I feel like that they should really have like done a that. Thing, though. Yes it was. It was like different times. Yeah, I mean maybe, but is... what I'm seeing a lot is do people compare you to Aspen a lot and no. I feel like I don't ever get compared to you, really. Yeah, I feel like we've done, I mean, mostly me, because you obviously started first, but I feel like, I've said this a billion times, but I feel like I've done a good job at, like, setting myself apart is not, like, Aspen Ovard's sister. Like, I get a lot of comments that are like, I didn't even know that you guys were sisters, and I, like, knew you both, but... See, that's weird, because our last name is not common. <laughs> yeah. What's your most embarrassing moment with Avery? <laughs> Do you have one in mind? Yeah. What is it? Um, when I fell off the segue. <laughs> <laughs> that was so freaking funny. It's like funny to look back on, but genuinely the amount of pain that I was in was like really bad. <laughs> if I wasn't in that much pain, like I would laugh and be like, oh, OMG, I can't believe I literally just fell. Um, long story short, we were with some of Aspen's like friends or just a friend, I guess, in LA, and we were riding segways. Her friend went this way and Parker went this way, and I didn't know who to follow, but right in the middle there was like a yellow pole, but it was like kind it's of like, short. Yeah, like this. And I tall. ran like right into it and I like flipped over it and I fell on my back and I got the wind <laughs> knocked out of me. <laughs> I was literally I You like, were laughing no so was laughing. Well, well yeah, because I was no in a lot of laughing, pain. So I was trying not to. Do you have a lip liner? Mm-hmm. But yeah, anyways. I was trying, no one else was laughing. What's up you guys? Really quick intermission. I wanted to thank today's sponsor, which is Casetify. I have worked with Casetify so many times. I love working with them. Casetify is a phone case company and I actually have my own collab with them. So this is my first case. It's just a clear case that says no more waiting. And then my second case is an EV case. Spot the difference, everyone. Caseify's phone cases are military grade drop proof, so I wanted to do a little drop test with my phone. Here is one of the first cases that I picked out, and then here is the second one. So if you would like to go purchase any cases from Caseify, they have literally so many different designs, including mine. Uh, this is my recommendation. If you want to get something, is my EV case, because I literally think it's perfect. This is like the first time in so long that I haven't had my EV case on. Here's what my phone looks like right now. No cracks or scratches or anything. So I'm putting it in one of their ultra impact cases so let's go test it she's clean if y'all could actually see but if you would like to get 20% off on your order you can go to casetify.com slash avriovard and you will automatically have 20% off thank you once again to casetify for sponsoring me i love casetify i literally have been wearing their phone cases for years go check them out i will have the link down below casetify.com slash avriovard for 20% off. Someone said, how many years are you apart? You're 24? Yeah. And I'm 18, so what's that? Six. Six? Who's better at Mario Kart? Definitely me. Definitely. I always think I'm good, and then I play, and, you play and, and I... You suck. Yeah, it's weird. <laughs> Someone says, was she jealous when you were born? <laughs> <laughs> was I jealous when you were born? I have no memory. I don't remember when you were born at all. Yeah, me either. I Here's. can use your Aspen Elvar Tarte palette. Okay. What would the relationship be like if you were older? That's interesting. I have no idea. I don't know either. I don't think I would be... I don't think I would have been mean to you, but like I can't say that because I don't know. I'm also like tougher than you. <laughs> like I'm not as sensitive. I feel like you are though, you just don't show it as much. Maybe, but like if I, like how when you were little, if I like said something to you, I like... Yeah, because you were mean me to me. No, but if I like said my opinion on I think it was whereas... because it all just built up. Because it was just like, it was not just like, oh, every once in a while you would tell me that like I needed to change my outfit or something. Like it was like all the time. I'm not saying you change your outfit all the time. I'm not no, I'm not even talking about that. I am really sensitive though. You used to just like take my crap though, and I wouldn't have taken your crap. Like yeah. up if you were older. Yeah, I mean, if we had the Way same personalities that we do now, yeah. Yeah. 
have I changed since becoming a mom? Yeah. How? I just feel like you like mind your business more. <laughs> <laughs> I'm too busy with my own. Yeah, babies. like you have too much stuff to do now. What else? Um, Am I like more I feel like and stuff? <laughs> I feel like you're like more loving and you're like more sensitive. Yeah. Not like more sensitive, but like more sensitive to like other people's feelings. Yeah. I have this vivid memory of you doing my makeup when I was younger. Yeah. And you were curling my eyelashes and you clamped my eyelid and I started crying and you told me to get over it. <laughs> <laughs> um, Aspen, is Jens your type? No. <laughs> I like Jens, he's fun, but he's just like not my type yeah. like at all. Yeah. Like Parker would also would not be your type. But I feel like Jens is more not my type than Parker would be not your type, don't you think? Not like a really I think way. it's pretty equal. Who's Dan and who's Phil? I'm definitely I'm Dirty Dan. Spray like a shiny. Okay. Yes, Prince Charles. It. You got half my face. <laughs> That's okay. I also am sponsored by Case to Five. <laughs> Here's my case. Have to stand up and curl it. Yeah, there's not any chairs over here. You can't go find one. Do you want me to? You're way too tall. You have to be like on your knees. So I brought you this outfit. I've had the shirt for a little but I just got the pants and I think it's so cute. So it's linen and it's just like a really that comfy cute. big. This is and the then shirt. It has matching pants. Yeah, so I have matching shorts and then I just got it's not very soft. the matching pants. They're just like comfy and oversized okay. and then I'll give you my necklaces because Okay. So yeah. <laughs> she literally has food on the way. Okay. <laughs> Okay, here's the final look. The pants are a little short because she's way taller than me. <laughs> but she has on my shoes. The pants are also kind of wrinkled, but that's the vibe. That's what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be maybe a little less wrinkly like the shirt, but this is the final look. Rise and shine. I feel like... This is like one of the best you've done. So I feel you like you've done makeup? my makeup several times. I'll put the picture in and it was that really was bad. years ago. <laughs> Only three years ago. That's a long time. Yeah, I just did really natural makeup. And then for the hair, just some nice curls. I actually wanted it a little bit less curly than that, but it's okay. And then yeah, this outfit's just like comfy. The pants are a little too wrinkled. Oh, I love it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope this was fun. Just a casual vid with my sister. Shout out to Casetify for sponsoring me. You can go Thank check you, out. Thank you, Casetify, for sponsoring me too. <laughs> They're awesome. So go check them out. Bye. Oh, go watch Aspen's video we did on her channel. Oh, yeah. Subscribe to me. <laughs>